Well, I haven't really been anywhere noteworthy or mentionable. Have you done anything noteworthy, mentionable? I just live by the ABCs. Adventurous, brave, creative. Hey, my man, you still there? No, I just like zoned out for a second. It's such a short little story, but it had such an impact because Thurber created this iconic character, something that everybody could connect with, somebody who's sort of going through the motions in their life but having a whole different life inside their head. I'm Walter Mitty. What is it you call it when he goes into one of his little places? Oh, zoned out. You do that now and then. Ben was determined to make a movie about a man who departs from his daydreams and steps into life. He ends up really living out a huge adventure that changes his life entirely. Why not? Follow that up. Go. Everyone be ready to roll. Action. You know, we ended up going to beautiful country of Iceland and doing most of our kind of worldly traveling. In that country, it represented three different countries in the movie, Greenland, Iceland, and the Nepalese border in Afghanistan. I was blown away by the experience because you feel like you're at the top of the world. I can't really talk right now. I'm on my way to a volcano. The challenging thing about making a film this size is your film crew has to shoot in the most complicated areas possible because that's where the energy comes from and that's where the intensity comes from. Help! Take the shark! Ah! When you're shooting a movie that takes place in New York, you just have to shoot there. There's no place in the world like it. Ready, keep the street clear! Keep the street clear! The most kind of outrageous fantasy is what we call the Ted Walter fight. It's mine! Give it to me! Most of it wanted to be as in-camera as possible. So we developed a rig that had a truss so we could suspend the two guys and we weave through traffic. The streets are just teeming with crowds of thousands watching us. It's definitely ambitious. A lot of the things we did I felt were a little unprecedented. <laughs> I found some interesting challenges in a Benjamin Button sequence. We're taking Ben's own face in the makeup and we're mixing it with visual effects for the body. We took a six-year-old kid and we replaced Ben's head onto her body so it looks like he's got this little shriveled body in his head. My little heart is no bigger than a quarter, but it's as full as Fort Knox. You know, it's great working with Ben, who does have a vision. This movie has it all comedy, drama, adventure. There was always clarity in his mind, which was astonishing given the fact that he was the actor and the director. And to be able to suddenly go from being intensely involved in the microcosm of a moment to pulling back and look at the macrocosm of the movie. This is like what filmmaking is all about. Life that's happening in the moment. How'd you get to Afghanistan? Through Yemen. Violent place. That's why the airfare is only $84.